Alright y'all, it's Snack Attack, we're here again. I'm in my pyjamas because they look snazzier than my regular clothes, so if you got a problem with that, there's the door. Today we're going to be looking at the new, well not so new, Red Bull flavours, which I think actually came out like four years ago. So first of all we have the Red Edition, also known as Cranberry Flavour. Um, I just call it the red flavor because that's what it is like these the names for these flavors don't mean anything This isn't cranberry flavored at all. It's uh, it's red flavored and um, I'm liking the design of these cans as well. I mean obviously with the red and I'm really liking this thing here I remember looking at this once <laughs> for like about a minute just really admiring the craftsmanship in this You know, I don't think it was it might have been just with a regular can, but I was just looking at the um, imprint of the uh, the bull there. And being really impressed by it, <laughs> but not impressed by my own life. Anyway, this is uh, probably my favourite of all the flavours, even more so than the original Red Bull, just your regular flavour. So, let's give it a shot. It's good that it's got that regular Red Bull flavour, but there's just an added sweetness to it, but there's the right amount of sweetness. It's not like going too far. The good thing is that these flavors haven't made Red Bull turn into Rockstar because Rockstar is like drinking paint. Like I said, this doesn't really have any sort of association with cranberry or it doesn't taste like cranberry juice much at all. I don't think there's really a fruity flavor to these new flavors, but you know, I think this one has the fruitiest flavor to it. Even though if it doesn't taste like cranberry, it just tastes like the fruit known as red. But anyway, that's uh, certainly my favorite of all, of probably just my favorite energy drink in general. It's just a really, it's a very successful, colorful, <laughs> flavored energy drink. And it doesn't taste like paint. Next up we have the blue edition. Oh boy. Also known as blueberry flavor. Like this just does not taste like blueberries at all. At all. No way. This tastes like Again, I'm liking these designs, you know. It's just kind of sexy. Actually, you know what? I think I changed my mind. I think I'm realizing just right now, maybe there is a bit of a blueberry flavor, you know. I think it comes from the smell. I think this is the smelliest energy drink, perhaps, ever. Or at least the smelliest of these new flavors. But, yeah, I don't know. I guess I just wasn't tasting it before. But now, you know, there's a little bit. I wouldn't... I still wouldn't say it's a really fruity taste, but yeah, I take it back. There's definitely a blueberry flavor in this, so fair enough that it's called blueberry flavor, um, but I'm still going to call it the blue flavor. Again, really good. A lot better than the... I remember having a blue rock star once, and it was just... It just tasted so artificial, and... It, it felt like it was an energy drink for robots, and I wasn't supposed to be drinking it, even though I am a robot. And lastly, we have the yellow flavor, also known as the summer edition, also known as tropical flavor, whatever that means. Alright, oh, what the hell, man? I just realized this isn't yellow. What the fuck, Red Bull? Jesus, sloppy effort. Oh. But anyway, I can just barely forgive him for that, but, um... Alright, let's just give this a taste, because last time I tried it, which was like 20 minutes ago, didn't taste very tropical to me. I mean, I think, I guess this has the most soft drink taste out of maybe any Red Bull flavor I've ever had. It does kind of taste like a, a solo or a lift, but with a bit more of a bitey taste to it. Again, very synthetic tasting, not very, like, fruity or flavorful, but... I think this may have the weirdest taste out of these three, but I still quite like it. I still seem to keep buying it, but I can't quite get my tongue around it. It just has a bit of a weird taste to it. Mm, I am guess I'm still trying to figure out exactly what I think of this, but like I say, you know, it's the closest to the soft drink, so... And I don't drink a lot of soft drink, but if you do, and you're picking up one of the flavors, then you probably want to grab this one. I'd say, since this is the one that tastes most like soft drink, this would be the go-to energy drink for Deros and Juvies out there. Because it goes well with a nice dairy. Well, that's my snack attack. That's my snack attack review of the Red Bull flavors. Yellow, blue, red. 
Not sure if that makes up a flag or if it's the colors of a country or something. I don't know. I should have done my research. Anyway, let me know in the comments if there are any. But yeah, I really like these new flavors. I think they're a good alternative to the regular flavor. I still like regular Red Bull quite a bit. But I'd only prefer the red edition over the original vanilla flavor. Well, it's not really a vanilla. Ooh. Hey, now that's a good idea. Red Bull vanilla flavor. How about Red Bull coconut flavor? Ooh, ooh, I'm coming up with all these great ideas. Maybe I just gotta do it myself. Mix Red Bull with um, coconut water. I'll give that a go if I remember. Anyway, this video is going on for too long. Get the hell out!